y'all what is up and welcome back to my channel for a brand new let's play for the sims 3 i'm so freaking excited it's gonna be a sim self slash generation series because let me just go ahead and explain this for those of you who were watching the sims 3 supernatural because i know i did put a poll out on twitter and was hyping it up and a lot of you the majority won so y'all wanted to see that but i apologize it kind of <laughs> failed on me i just could not get into it at all i'm just not into that supernatural storyline it doesn't interest me that much i know um and honestly the sims 3 is my least favorite generation of the game not because it's not fun but there's so many like kinks to it but since i got a new computer it's been running fine the graphics look good um i just need something that's going to entertain me so i figured it'd be fun to create my sim self and my boyfriend and our dog and just kind of start with us and see how many generations we get into because I don't know I just feel like that'd be like interesting to me because you know it's me it's myself and you know my, my boyfriend and the sims and I don't know I just feel like it'd be hilarious <laughs> and yeah so let me go ahead and just introduce you to my sim self and our house so oh whoa my bad. Okay, so this is our house. This is super cute. Um, we live in Appaloosa Plains. Um, I downloaded this nice house off of The Sims Resource because uh, I can't be bothered to build in The Sims 3 because honestly, I'm so used to The Sims 4. I don't even remember how to do it in The Sims 3. Um, so yeah, this is the house that we're going to start off in. Um, our goal in life together as a boyfriend and girlfriend one day husband and wife is to have a white farmhouse that's like my dream house and you know one day when we're able to like build you know we will have that but you know it is the sims and you know i could start off this bougie life that i'll probably never live but i wanted to be realistic about it so i purchased this little house for us as a little starter home you know because we're not even technically engaged in the game yet because we aren't in real life so you know we're gonna first mission is to make sim todd propose to sim carissa because i'm just waiting patiently you know what i'm saying but yeah this is our house let me give you a little tour of it and introduce you to um me <laughs> That's so weird, Hannah uh, Todd. So this is our living room where I, I don't know, it's so weird saying where I'm sitting, where Carissa is sitting. Should I refer to myself as Carissa? I don't know, it's so weird. <laughs> um, and then here's the kitchen and dining where we have Todd <laughs> teaching Chloe how to sit. Then over here we have three bedrooms. This one's empty. And then this one I'm using as an office. Then we have a bathroom, and we have like a little nursery, which I'm just going to leave it a nursery so I don't have to redecorate it when we do have a child. And then this is our bedroom and laundry room, bathroom, and car, which is really cool because this is actually the car I have. I have a Kia Sportage, um, but this is a 2011. I have a 2017, and it's kind of this color. So close enough to the color as I could get it, so that's really freaking cool. Um, and then this is Todd's truck. Um, he doesn't have a Ford F-150. He actually has a Chevy Silverado, but it's black, but they didn't have Chevy Silverado that I could find. So uh, that'll do. But anyways, yeah, let me introduce you to my sim self real quick. <laughs> okay, so this is Carissa. <laughs> so weird, but it's hilarious. Okay, so this is Carissa. She looks just like me, not really. <laughs> She's a lot prettier than I am. Um, anyways, I guess we can go over her symbology. All right, so um, I am over-emotional because I am very over-emotional. Um, I'm not, like, dramatic. I'm just over-emotional. Like, I'm very sensitive um, so when I'm happy, I get over happy. When I'm sad, I get over sad. When I'm mad, I'm very hot headed. I'm just over emotional. So I like having these traits, these extra traits and just being honest with myself. Good sense of humor. Um, I think I have a good sense of humor. I feel like I'm like toot my own horn telling you my traits, but like, I don't know. I like to laugh. I like to make people laugh. And I'm, you know, I'm just kind of lighthearted like that. Or I take, you know, I don't take life too seriously. So I would say good sense of humor. I'm family oriented. I am a hopeless romantic and I am a dog person. Uh, my favorite is country music is my favorite. Um, I put goopy carbonara as my favorite food because I like pastas and purple is my favorite color. Um, right now, I don't have a job because um, I just haven't got that far yet. <laughs> um, and honestly, I'm not sure if I'm going to give myself a sim job, a sim self a job because... <laughs> 
um, my boyfriend, Todd, like, told me in real life, you know, when we get married or, you know, if something was happening and I was to get pregnant, that um, I wouldn't have to work until the baby was a little bit older because he'd want me to stay home with the baby. And so, like, I'm on a mission to start my family. So, I'm just going to be a stay-at-home sim mom to Chloe, at least, until we get married and have babies. So, I'm just going to hold off on me getting a job for right now. Uh, so yeah, that is me. I don't have any friends <laughs> besides my boyfriend and my dog, which is accurate. <laughs> and so anyways, this is Todd. Oh my God, he's so cute. Uh, let me try to get him to look up. Will you look up, Todd? Look at me. Look at me, baby. Look at me. Okay, he ain't looking at me. Oh wait, he's getting down on Chloe's level. Okay, we'll do this. We'll do this. We'll do it like this. So this is Ty. He's even so cute as a sim. <laughs> um, I tried to give us, you know, our tattoos because we both have tattoos. He has a, quite a few tattoos, like on his arms and stuff. Um, so I tried to get him in the right spots and as accurate as possible. Um, and I don't know, it was it was so much fun creating us because like trying to create our create our style. Um, he always like in the summertime he always wears khaki shorts. I don't know what it is, but he wears them khaki shorts and like a t shirt, black t shirt. He always wears his hat backwards, but there was no hat backwards wearing hairstyle that I could find that was cute, so we just did his hair like that. But yeah, I think he's so cute. I love him. <laughs> and um so a little bit about him, I'll give you his symbology. Um, he loves the outdoors, he loves to be outside, he can never like sit inside and like watch TV with me or anything like that because he's just, he wants to be outside and doing something. So yeah, he's family oriented, he's definitely a family man. Um, he's hot headed, he has quite a temper, um, and so he's sensitive so like when you, you upset him, he, he gets pretty mad, so he's hot headed. Um, he's a hopeless romantic, he is such a sweetheart, <laughs> and he is a dog person, uh, he loves Chloe, which is like his daughter, um, he's had her since he was like, I think he started his freshman year in college, so she's probably about 10 years old, so she's pretty old, but this is Chloe, and he also, um, has like a bunch of beagle dogs too, because he's like into like rabbit hunting and stuff like that, I know we're from the country, so <laughs> that's the thing down here, but I didn't, I mean, he has probably about 20 beagle dogs, so I'm not going to create 20 beagle dogs, and just not, so we just created Chloe. Um, and his career, he is in the medical career, which he's not really in the medical career. He's actually in a, he, you know, what, what do you, I don't even know what you would call it. Like, it's like manual labor stuff, you know, but they don't have that option in the sim. So I was like, okay, he always said, you know, at one point when he was younger, he wanted to be a pediatrician, you know, he wanted to be a doctor. So, you know, we're living the the sim life, the big life, the bougie life. So we're going to have him in the medical career so he can make that money for me to be a stay-at-home mom and so we can get our white farmhouse. So, yeah, that's what career he's in. He doesn't have any friends but me and Chloe. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, we haven't made friends yet in the neighborhood. So we're working on that. Um, his favorite music, country. He likes steak. And I, I, I don't really know. He doesn't really have a favorite color, but he tends to wear black a lot. Um, so I just gave him the color black. <laughs> but yeah, that's us. And yeah, let's just, let's go ahead and play. Um, I don't really know what we're going to do. I know the college mascot person is here, but we're not going to college. <laughs> um, our kids are going to go to college though, but yeah, I don't know. I hope you guys are, you know, are going to enjoy this. I mean, I, don't know, I think it's kind of going to be weird at first, me like watching my sims like woohoo and try for like babies and like talking about myself like, referring to myself and stuff oh carissa wants to get married <laughs> like she really does you know and so does he so you know what that's our first mission you know what can we just go ahead and do that <laughs> i ain't wasting no time um we can do that right we can yeah let's do that okay so let's look around town and see where is a romantic spot that we can take Todd to propose to Carissa. <laughs> so weird. He would die. He would die if I knew I was. If he knew I was doing this, I haven't told him I was doing this yet. Oh my gosh. Uh, what would be rom? No, we're not going to do that. Okay, never mind. I'm not even going to tell you what I was going to do because I we're not wasting any more time. Um, I guess we could go, like go over here to the beach. That's a cemetery. <laughs> we're not going to go to the cemetery. Um, here's a tree park, which is. This is actually very pretty, but it's kind of creepy because it's by the cemetery. I'm not really sure if I'm into all of that. So, I mean, I guess we could come over here to this beach. Probably as romantic as it's going to get, honestly. <laughs> um, and, yeah, we're just going to go ahead and have him do what I want him to do. So, let's uh, 
go here with Carissa. Okay. Yay. I'm going to pretend like I have no idea what's going on. It's going to be such a shock. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, he's leaving me. Todd, you're le <laughs> What? Todd, 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 you're leaving me. Babe, hey, hey. Oh, my God. Carissa, you are going to mess up your own proposal. You want it so bad, girl, but I guess you took too long. You left your ass. <laughs> Todd. Wait, okay, look. We're just going to meet him there. Okay, we're gonna meet him there. He, ha we're gonna pretend he has to go like get it all romantic and set up, you know. Um, so <laughs> let's just go here. I don't know why I didn't go with him. He really did. He just hopped in the truck. Like, S all right, see you there then. Bye. <laughs> oh my god, this is hilarious. Todd, now he's gonna go swimming. No, 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 Todd. You wish you had that many abs in real life. <laughs> okay. No, Todd, out of your swimwear. Okay, come over here and you tell her. Give her a dick kiss. Tell Carissa, tell me, tell me, tell me how much you love me. <laughs> this is so weird, y'all. Are, are, are we gonna do it standing in the water? Okay, let's, let's not, I don't, I don't wanna get my shoes, I don't wanna get my shoes wet, okay? Oh, it's so sweet. Ask to be protected. What does that mean, y'all? Ask to be protected? Um, I don't know what that means. What does that mean? Ask to be confessed to watching you while s <laughs> What the hell? <laughs> confessed to watching you while you sleep? <laughs> I've never seen that before. I don't remember seeing that. Where did that get protected go? Conf okay, let's see what happens when he confesses to watching her while she sleeps. No, 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 no. You're not about to relax here. I watch you while you sleep. Oh, no, honey. Oh, okay. Well, she liked it. I was about to say, her reaction, I was like, okay, that's freaking weird. Um, ask to be protected. What does that mean? Make promise to protect. Oh, Oh, yes, that's so sweet. Make a promise to protect you. I'm going to protect you for the rest of your life. I love you. Oh, my God. So freaking sweet. <laughs> okay, and now, I mean, why can't I propose? We have to just keep working it up. Oh, maybe it's because he's a hopeless romantic. So, maybe that's why he has those, um, those little options. Like, I don't remember seeing that, but... Oh... Oh, you're so sweet. Okay, I'm just going to keep keep on working them up. Flirtatious joke, you know. Let's give her a hug. I'm trying to have the option to propose. Not seeing it yet. Oh, okay. He's kissing my neck and I'm making out with his nose. <laughs> oh, Todd, calm down, honey. We, we, we're we not done yet. She, I, I love how I'm just laughing at him. That's so accurate. Okay, wow. Do not do that. <laughs> Y'all, this is like not going well. I just want him to propose, but now we're having to do all this unnecessary stuff. Oh, look at us making out in the sunset. This is so freaking cute. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, we are the OTP. I tell you what. Okay. Y'all, I feel like this is, I, I thought this would just be fun, but I feel like it's turned very creepy because y'all are just watching me have my sim self and boyfriend like make out. <laughs> But just just work with me now, y'all. We're, we're, this is going to be generations. I think it'll be fun. It'll be cool to, you know, <laughs> see my kids grow up in The Sims. Okay, proposed marriage. Here we go. Here we go. <gasps> and, of course, I'm going to say yes. <laughs> oh, babe. We're married. <laughs> oh, we're not married. I'm sorry. God, I'm getting way ahead of myself. That's just like me. We're engaged. <laughs> Oh, okay, so congratulations. Todd and Carissa are now engaged. They can get married at a wedding party or if they prefer something a little more pri or intimate, a private wedding. Okay, cool. All right, so now we're hungry. It's 7.06 p.m. Um, we can make this a cute little date. We can have him come over here and serve us hot dogs. Um, I mean, that's probably my least favorite thing to eat, but... <laughs> I mean, I just got engaged, so I'm going to go for it. I'm going to go for following the leader. Okay. 
Okay, that's just like me. I'm like his shadow. He makes fun of me all the time because no matter where he goes, I'm with him like every single day. So wherever he goes, I go. Like if he goes down the hallway, I'm right behind him. I'm literally his shadow. I just love him so much. <laughs> oh my God, this is so creepy. It's turned into me like obsessing. I figured this would happen. But look, he's making me some hot dogs and I'm working on my tan. This is so cute, y'all. This is gonna be so much fun. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm such a nerd. Okay. All right, so I'm going to get up and come over here and eat my hot dog. And um, we're going to, me, I, I already have my wedding plan on Pinterest, you know. So I guess we can go ahead and start discussing when we're going to get married. Um, obviously, we're going to do it on a weekend. So we're going to have like one full week of being an um, engaged couple. One full week, which we're going to say that equals a few months. Because it'll probably be another season, you know, yeah. So, yeah, we'll get married in the fall. Okay. All right, Zach. Oh, we're generous. Oh, you're starving. I'm I'm down for it. I mean, we just got engaged. Hi. You, would you like a hot dog? Would you like to celebrate with us? Sure. It's <laughs> like, what the hell, dude? I love it because that is like him. He, oh, my God. Okay. Anyways. Um, I appreciate Sims who take it upon themselves to learn a new craft. Let's get to know each other better. Zach, I just told you I'm an engaged woman. Back the hell off, son. Todd, are you really are you really gonna do that? Rude introduction. I mean, I, I love how I'm I'm making him no friends. We're, we're gonna start off making enemies, but really, dude, really, really, don't don't let him hit on me like that, Todd. Don't let him. Just just tell him that it's inappropriate. Inappropriate, son. <laughs> okay, Carissa, you cannot get a tan at nine o'clock, honey, hunty. I couldn't get one when I was trying to tan earlier either. I didn't realize it was like 7 o'clock. It's actually, yeah, no. You're not going to get a tan, honey. Go home. All right, so I'm going to have them go on home. Uh, oh, my God, we need to check on Chloe and make sure Chloe's okay. I don't want to neglect the baby. Um, she's just patiently waiting on Mommy and Daddy. Let's have her come out here and pee because she, she's about to pee-pee on herself. Um, so I have her a little bed over here to sleep in, which is actually hilarious because she's she'd laugh. She if dogs could laugh, she's she'd she's gonna look at us like we're crazy in real life. If we used to get her a bed like that, she'd look at us like oh, you're crazy. Um, she's spoiled rotten, so she sleeps in the bed with us, <laughs> and she likes to take up the whole foot of the bed. So in the middle of the night, we're always kicking her over, and she'll literally go. <laughs> like growl at us so yeah we're gonna enjoy our our sim selves are gonna enjoy the bed to ourselves while you know chloe sleeps on her dog bed which is cute um all right so it looks like i've got to potty so let's come over here and use the restroom i'm like freaking out over my ring i'm so excited i'm, I'm excited <laughs> um and we're gonna have him come over here i guess and go to sleep because i do believe todd has work in the morning doesn't he no, Todd, you're not gonna read something. That's not like you. You don't read. Let's let's be let's be honest now. Okay, so yeah, he does have work at nine o'clock in the morning, and I don't have work, so I'm not really sure what I'm gonna get into. Probably go around town, find out where I can, you know, get married, where we can have our wedding. Um, go ahead and start planning all of that, and let's have Chloe. What is she doing? What is she chewing on? Okay, she's tearing up plants. Okay. Let's have her come and sleep so we can all just go ahead and go to sleep. And, yeah, I will see y'all in the morning. And I guess we're going to take Carissa or me. Is that, that's so, that sounds so weird. Carissa or me? We're going to take me? We're going to take me? We're going to take Carissa. We're, I'm going to refer to myself as Carissa, okay? <laughs> we're going to take Carissa to go find out where uh, we can plan our wedding, what venue, and whatnot. Okay, so apparently in The Sims, I'm an early riser, which... This is an alternate universe because that would never actually happen. No way I'd be out of bed at 5 o'clock or six before 6 o'clock in the morning when I don't have a job to go to. But um, I guess maybe I'm just excited that I'm engaged <laughs> and I want to be like wifey material. So let's come over here and serve some breakfast. We'll serve some waffles. That's all I know how to cook, which is accurate. <laughs> All right, so it looks like Todd's up, and he has to, you know, shower and get ready for work and everything. It is his first day. He is an organ donor. <laughs> so he does need to work on his logic in order to get a promotion. We don't have a chess table, but can you play chess on the computer? I don't remember. Can you do that? Play chess? Okay, yeah, so you can play chess on the computer in The Sims 3, which... I wish you could do in The Sims 4. It just make things a lot easier than having like a freaking chess table in your house or going to the park if you need to gain logic. You know what I'm saying? So I appreciate that, Sims 3. I really do. Look at me being wifey material. I'm just showing him. You may. 
<laughs> did, you, <laughs> did y'all hear that? I just like choked. Oh my spit. Oh my god. This is so embarrassing. <laughs> I'm just showing him that he made the right decision by finally putting a ring on it. I mean, can I get an amen? Whew. All right. Like, that hurt. I just, like, choked on my spit. How embarrassing. I could edit that out, but I'm probably not. <laughs> you know what? This is my sim self. We're going to be real. We're going to be raw. Uh, and we're going to be honest. Uh, the carpool for Todd will come in about an hour. Okay, so what does he need to do? He needs to eat. He also needs to work on that uh, fun. So let's have him come over here and watch some TV before the food's ready. Um, how are you doing, baby? Your garden, your bowl. Well, why don't you eat? Go ahead and eat, sweetheart. <clears throat> Watch me burn the waffles. That is very likely to happen. I would not be surprised. What is he wearing? What the hell is he wearing? I did not give him that outfit. Todd, honey. What in the world? Is that his work uniform? I'm a little concerned. We're going to need lots of money. <laughs> I've got big plans for our wedding. I'm going to need a little bit of extra cash. Could you transfer some over into my account? You know, I got some wedding planning to do. <laughs> Poor Todd. But, you know, realistically, in The Sims, we can just mother load that ish <laughs> and have, like, the most beautiful, perfect wedding in the world. Um, I'm probably going to have to download um, a place to have a wedding. Um, I'm not really sure where I, I can have a wedding here in Appaloosa Plains um, besides like maybe the beach but I'm not going to have a fall beach wedding so I may have to like download a venue oh we could do it well if this was like an actual farm that'd be really cute to have like a southern like farm wedding but I think this is somebody's house right I mean, yeah, I, I might, maybe I can find a venue or something. I'm going to have to look for that in my spare time. But, I mean, I, I honestly don't think there's anything um, in Appaloosa Plains that's going to be good enough <laughs> for me and my wedding. I just, I'm not seeing anything here. So, um, I looks like I'm playing fetch with Chloe. I guess I'm going to have some fun with her because poor baby's been a little bit neglected. And, um, oh, she wants to become best friends with her mommy. Um... So yeah, uh, I don't know. What else can we do? I know the Summer Fest Festival, yeah, is in town. We could do that because we do need to make some friends. We don't know anybody. <laughs> um, so, uh, I mean, our, I guess we don't do a welcome wagon in The Sims 3. I guess that's not a thing that we do. So let's stop playing fetch Chloe. And where is the Summer Festival? I think it's over out, yeah, out here. So let's go to the Summer Festival and see if we can make any friends because i mean honestly at this point we might as well just get married in our living room or in our backyard because we don't even have any friends to invite to the wedding so first things first you got to make some friends and go figure there is absolutely freaking nobody here Ugh. okay well hopefully everybody will show up since I'm here, maybe it'll, like, generate some sims, spawn them in. We have our little hot dog stand worker. We can socialize with her. Is this the Zach guy? Okay, Zach, don't you dare. Don't you dare. He, okay, you know what? Well, we know Zach. We can invite Zach. Oh, Jaslyn Parrot. I believe that's one of our neighbors, and she's pregnant. She's so cute. She can be our friend. So, friendly introduction. Okay, I'm trying to remember all of this families from Appaloosa Plains and The Sims 3. And if I'm correct, correct me if I'm wrong. I'm going to have to look into it. But I, I want to say that the parents, I know they live next to us, but I really want to say that her husband is like unfaithful and he kind of cheats on her. I think I'm right. So we're gonna go ahead and tell her, I'm engaged, I'm your neighbor, I just got engaged. How awesome is that? Like, if it was about wedding, we're just gonna talk about ourselves and our wedding the whole time. Maybe, <laughs> maybe talk about her a little bit. Um, <laughs> ask her uh, to fill her tummy. I mean, we just met you, but can I fill your tummy? <laughs> let's not talk to the tummy, that's a little bit too weird. Um, let's get to know her a little bit. Um, is she a young adult or is she an adult? I'm not sure. I want to say she's a young adult, but you know what? It doesn't matter. She can teach us all about, you know, the married life. Maybe if I'm correct about her husband, maybe we don't want to, uh, <laughs> take any advice from them because they don't seem to have a very successful marriage. Um, but, you know, she can teach us all, you know, about being a mom and, yeah, okay. And, oh, I remember her. Hey, 
Hey, Jackie Miller. I want to talk to you and your cowgirl hat girl. You is cute. Let's come over here and talk to her. We're just trying to make some friends, y'all. We need some friends for our wedding, so let's come over here. We're just introducing ourselves, letting everybody know. Hi, I'm Carissa. I just got engaged. How are you? <laughs> oh, I want to visit Chaps Le Sims France. Oh, that came out really wrong. Don't ignore my awful French accent. That was terrible. I took French for three years in high school. I don't remember anything. <laughs> um... But yeah, we can go there for our honeymoon. Okay, I'm glowing. I'm looking good. Hey, have you traveled around the world? I couldn't help but notice your natural, healthy glow. I can't read. Everyone, Carissa Wheeler knows. <laughs> um, yeah, I love that tattoo right there. See that little tattoo on my arm? That is so accurate. I have a tattoo right there above my forearm. And it says, um, or right below my bicep. Is that what that is? I don't know. But it says, fear not. So that's accurate. I'm going to come over here and have fun with this cat. Cute. Okay. <laughs> I don't see anybody else at this festival. It's looking a little bit dead, which is another thing that I really dislike about The Sims. Um, the Sims 3 is that, like, when you go to a community lot, it, nobody's ever there. Ever. It's, like, vacant. And it sucks. I don't know if there's a mod that, you know, fixes that. I, I would hope so. But, like, this is a cute little park place. We could get married here. Um, maybe, like, if we could catch it before the, the next festival happened. You know what I'm saying? That'd be really cute because, see, we... Oh, yes. Yeah, yeah I'm, I'm going to look into that. Or, you know what? We could even rearrange the, the fall. I, I don't know. We're going to work on it. We're, Carissa's going to figure out, you know, no doubt. She's going to find out where we're going to have this wedding. We're going to make it happen. we got to make some friends first. Um, he's doing business as usual. Maybe we need to um, chat with coworkers and let him meet some friends. Y'all, when I was playing off camera, when I, I had him go to the hospital, his boss, this, this woman right here, Haley Shepard, <laughs> she's like, I'd love to get to know you. Um, I got so pissed. I bitch, I wish you would. <laughs> you ain't gonna get to know my man. Uh, it's gonna be real interesting seeing me get ter ter territorial over all these sims after my man. Because you know, like, when, when you are around them, it's like, oh, an attractive company. I hope I see him have that little moodlet around another woman. <laughs> I'm gonna be pissed. <laughs> but anyways, y'all, um, I think I'm gonna go ahead and probably just go ahead and wrap this part up here. Because um, this is just kind of like a little opening to it. Just to see how y'all are receptive of it. Hopefully y'all think it's going to be entertaining. Um, I mean, what can be more entertaining than watching me, my sim self, lick, <laughs> lick this snow cone. I'm just really getting into it. I'm really savoring the flavor right now. <laughs> Anyways, y'all, if you enjoyed this and you're looking forward to it, please give it a big thumbs up. Comment what you want to see happen down below. And, yeah, me and Sim Carissa, we're going to plan a wedding. We're going to get it all set up. We're going to make some friends. Get down, Jazlyn's good, ain't a girl? <laughs> Anyways, y'all, thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe if you have not, and I will see y'all later.